Niggas so hard, I could cry right now. God. I was doing shows for like two bucks, right? That nigga Lil Pump was like, that nigga Lil Pump made a video. He's like, you niggas do shows for fifteen hundred, two thousand. I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> I swear to God, I swear to God, nigga came a long way, man. That's crazy. I did the first run off of five thousand. That's what I'm saying. That's not even an even like amount of money, like six hundred. Yeah, you just five hundred, a thousand. Nigga said. Man, I was like money. nineteen on like ten Zans that day. You think I cared about six hundred? That's real. Man. I swear to Zans, bro. We used to be fried. Yeah. I'm from Chicago. You talking about 2016 or 2015? 2015 before. The one before the one with all yeah, us. Yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah, the first yeah. one. Can y'all do so many Zans? Before they though, was even calling that shit SoundCloud rap. Mm -hmm. Literally, they weren't even mm -hmm. calling it SoundCloud rap. 2015 wrong line. That one didn't have. Who was on that? Yeah. Really? Yeah. That's crazy. Them niggas came a long way. What? Matt and Tariq? Man. What's up? What's up? How you feeling? I'm trying to get skinny like you out of nowhere. Yeah, trying to pop I'm, up like that. Man, I'm you glad broke. you said that because <laughs> that that's our first topic. My <laughs> uh, first, before we get into it, let's, let's, let's actually get into the fact. Um, obviously, we got to let you know that everything... We're not in our safe place, but it's still a safe place. We brought the enchantment with us, and everything that you say is good, confidential, and will not leave this. We don't do the internet. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. I Man, as you guys at home can see, you're obviously like, where the f are these guys? No, I didn't get kicked out of my house because I own it, but we are out of town because, as you know, I am on tour and. Tune is a busy man, so we had to come find him. Wait, you just said you got kicked out of your house? Yeah, yeah, did y'all just see that? Like, it's like a viral video. But like, China, she told somebody, like, if I get evicted, and they was like, I thought you owned the house. And she was like, I do. <laughs> but then she got caught in the lie. Check this out. If I get evicted, fuck everybody. How you gonna get evicted and you own the house? Because guess what, bitch? It's called, um, you can. How? Get off my lot. <laughs> oh, 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 I literally nah. just saw that 20 minutes nah, ago. I ain't see that. That's hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you owned it. <laughs> Damn, that's 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 funny. As shit. I don't want no smoke, Miss Tokyo or like <laughs> China. Yeah, just, shit, shit. You know Did you know she was thick? Who, her mom? Yeah, I know stuff. Yeah. I didn't know that. Because <laughs> uh, because she like loose thick. Gio though. is obsessed with her. Yeah, and it's weird. And I was like, like, what did she sent me something and she was twerking? I was like, what the fuck? She got a watch calling? Yes. What's the watch calling? OF? What, nigga, whatever. BBL? No, 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 no. It's homegrown. I think she do got like the little Born 80s BBL. BBL. <laughs> she probably got a little secret, secret BBL. <laughs> yeah, for sure. For sure she got nah, that. Nah, no, I think it's real. I think it's real. It's the kind that when you wear the leggings and it hang down, you see the stretch marks. Mm -hmm. Like a butterfly camp stamp type That's the one. You got to start going to the gym? Jeez. Yeah. No, no gym. It's just. It's but you just, got to start going to the gym. Or it's just going to start looking like how you But it, it's, 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 that it's the one that it ain't been to the gym. Yeah. It's a bunch of 40s and black and miles. <laughs> they just said 40s. Yeah. 40s. Yeah, because we take this back in, the, this back in that time. The like, point I'm getting to is that I would consider. Probably, yes. Black China's mom. Mm. I didn't say that. I ain't joking. I used to want to hear Mama D. She mean looking. Who's Mama D? That's why I can flock a mama. No, 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 no. Yeah. That's dead. Mama D is like, I think. You talking about Keisha oh, Cole Mama? Oh, this little mama? scrappy mama. He talking about Keisha Cole Mama. No way you talking about Keisha Cole Mama. <laughs> Girl, you're not talking about Keisha, Keisha Cole Mama. I'm saying I used to want to. Keisha Cole Mama was a full on crackhead. <laughs> I swear to God. Wait, hold on. Is that the <laughs> Wait, which one? Which one? Super skinny body. <laughs> she had no teeth. Super oh, yeah. skinny. Yeah. Just like Yo. she was on the show though, right? Yeah. Yeah. She was on the show while no, those my two weird ones I want to hit is her and then Wendy Williams. But the, the, the other one. Yeah. What? Those are my two weird. You know Bro, you Wendy got Wendy Williams looks like it's the same place. You don't have, you don't, Shit. You, know what I'm you don't have that that one weird. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, but I can't yeah. tell people. No, you, here on you can. God, you can't. On God, here I, you on can. God, I would. Ne you would have to put a bullet to my, <laughs> that man my could eyebrows. I swear to God. I to I swear to God. <laughs> but I did see a picture when he was in the '80s, and she was really beautiful. Uh, That's no, not I'm, what you're talking about, though. You're talking about my introduction to Wendy Williams, though, was Lil Wayne. I didn't even know who she was. They remember Lil Wayne said, "Fuck Wendy Williams, that look like a dude." Fuck Wendy Williams, the bitch look like a dude. Her body looks chewed and her hair looks glued.
That's my introduction to Whitney Williams. <laughs> so I would never want to play. <laughs> like, that's my introduction to her. I'm like, who Whitney Williams? Oh, this Whitney Williams. Okay. That's pretty crazy. Damn. <laughs> he, that, he said that. Y'all ain't keeping it. So it's, it's not one person where it's like, you know, people like, but you a hit. Like, it's kind of like, I'm going to the grave with my eyes. Grave? <laughs> I'm going to the grave. It's too soon. It's like, ooh. But I ain't gonna cap. After her teeth fell off on stage, I, I was turned. I was. I wanna different. say it too if I. Had Who teeth one. fell out on stage? First off, why was she on stage? I think she's a rapper. I think she's a rapper. <laughs> yes, I'm just she was rapper. <laughs> Feel weird, y'all. You know, y'all on y'all pocket. Y'all got y'all technique to how to hold the yeah. mic cool. Shit, niggas I'm like rapping. a rookie. Man, just do it like just. This is how you hold the oh, mic with rapping. This is how you hold the mic like this. <laughs> like that. You can't I don't know do why that. you do that. Yeah. Yeah. Well, all right. Let's get into. We get high. We get fat. We get high. We get fat. We get high. We get fat. Damn. First off. When I, the best I, way to start a song. I think when I, I was going to yes. I was skinny that. when I said that. When I heard that line, Man, that I, was before I, I was really listening to you. And he played that for me, and it. I was trying to convert him. It blew my <laughs> mind. I thought it was the most impressive yeah. opening line to a song. It'd be, you know, where I get that from though. Y'all don't remember they used to say the gangsters get chubby and move to Miami. That's where I get that from. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Still, just to start. It was but just yeah, the way just like on some young like saying wanna, that shit. Yeah. That's why. I think like you're like one of the first this. or only niggas who embrace gaining weight. I really, it's really like a like a little karma thing, not karma, but I, I wish this on myself because I used to want to be like Sosa and Gucci man, mm. and I was skinny as hell trying to get a little pudge. Mm. Then I like I got it, but I stopped caring about having it. You feel me? I yeah, wish this on myself. Didn't stop growing. Yeah, I wished it on myself. Come yeah. on, this guy is crazy. Yeah, he was yeah. just here. Yeah, like, yeah. I know you don't. I know you're not letting him yeah. crack fat jokes yeah, and shit yeah. on you. No, no, I'm just, no, I'm just. No. I mean, I'm just saying, like, brother. Oh my God, you're not acting like this. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> Nine months, <laughs> pregnant. Um, that's so. That's crazy. That is yeah, an interesting is goal. You to want to get. It's kind of glazing, ain't like, it? Where we from? Like you, we from? You love a rapper so much, you, you want to get big. Come on, watch out. Like, like where we from? Where we from? It's like, remember, when niggas used to be like, he got money, he got, he getting fake, getting money. <laughs> it's that yeah. type shit. Cause he gained weight. That's what I thought yeah. it was. Yeah. yeah, he's always saying. He's saying Bro, niggas be in the streets not eating mm-hmm. all day. And then niggas just go in my kitchen. That's true. I guess that is true. If you ain't got no money, you don't eat. You don't eat if you ain't got no money. Oh yeah, kings were fat. Oh yeah, because they, yeah. they sat and ate all day. I'm just drank going wine. in tradition. That's all I'm doing. Okay, so when you when you first got into drinking, right? Which was when? I was on Zans first. That's back in. That's because Zans Zans is cheap. So that's probably. I was back, on back. Zans first, and then the drink came. That shit came. I always wanted to drink lean though, because of Lil Wayne though. I was a real impressionable kid, you know. I was like super impressionable. Mm. So I always wanted to drink lean. Then when I started getting older, it just fit. Niggas started getting, that's when lean oh, was $40 a line. You could afford, oh, okay. Oh, you were beginning, like what, 2016? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lean yeah. 40 a line. Mm. You remember that? Go there. You remember you get some red for like 50 bucks. Damn. You get a pint for $1,000. Damn. I will not even think about buying pints then. Yeah, 2016? <laughs> that shit sounded crazy. Yeah. That shit, that shit <laughs> sounded crazy. <laughs> Wait, when, when did you start getting $1,000? Like, what time? What year are you talking about? Gang, niggas, 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 about niggas don't remember. Niggas was calling me a legend, and I was rapping for free. I just started getting relative. Like, I'm like two, three years into, like, getting money for real, for real. Yeah. Like, niggas was calling but me, and I was rapping for, for free. Since I was... Six, 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 seventeen. Yeah, sixteen. I dropped out of school because I was rapping. Because niggas used to come up to me in school like, "Yeah, bro, I just saw your song." I'm like, shut the fuck up. I was shy, so I dropped out because of that. Mm-hmm. Like, you know, I go to a hood ass school, so I'm, I'm, I'm in this bitch. Niggas, like, niggas listen to straight around that time trap shit, whatever. I'm making fucking cloud music. Like, mm-hmm. I ain't even want people. To, I ain't feel like explaining it. So I just was too shy. I just dropped out because of that. What's cloud music? So going crazy Wait, what's cloud music? Like, cloud music is like. Like the weirdo shit, like you know, not like SoundCloud. No, just like all before, like, like Rocky and shit, like Joey yeah, Badass yeah, yeah, and yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, I didn't know that it was shit. called Cloud Music. Yeah, that shit was called Cloud Music. Cloud, cloud Music. Have you heard that term for it? The era I'm from. That's the era I'm rapping on from. I didn't know that was a term for it. Have you ever heard that before? 
Really? I never I never heard that before. Uh and okay, and that's twenty thirteen, right? Mm-hmm. Twenty thirteen. Yeah. Damn, that's Sosa's era. Nice. But he's twenty eleven. Like yeah, twenty eleven, but twenty twelve when he took 2012. over. He the world. blew up twenty twelve, yeah. right? Man, rapping like that in an era of Sosa, you were crazy. Yeah, There's on. no way I would have. <laughs> I would have never would have. <laughs> <been. laughs> that nigga was on the other side Man, being what? cool as fuck. Wait, he was on your side being cool as fuck. I would have been like, bro, I got to. been so I got a like, nigga bro. wearing tight Gucci shirts and like, I was like, well, I'm tripping. Like, the time, though, All this smiggity smacking, just biggity backing. Look. You was really rapping too. You was, was rapping. Yeah, and like, yeah, like how I was though, like I really like, I really just wanted to be different. That's why I was rapping like that, like. <laughs> like my mom used to tell me, like I was dressed in a certain way. Like she was like, "You gonna when you turn like eighteen, you gonna be embarrassed by this shit." I'm like, "Bro, shut up, bro." Like, but all that shit, I just wanted to be different. Like you from a certain place, like you just see the same shit. I yeah. just knew I didn't want to be that I shit. I feel that. That's real. For real for I was real. the exact same way. I swear to God. Yeah. And, and then when did that switch hit? When was that switch that you was like, wait? Like fuck that first song this you made, shit. I was like, like when did it go from like Lucky X to like? Nah, I'm lucky. Like 2016, like it was like the pack. Like you can't force your friends to listen to that music when y'all driving around in the car. Wow, I want to make music that, that my friends be, listen to. That's that's some of the realest shit you yeah, could have. That's where that ever came from. Said. Like I never used I to listen to my lucky old shit. to hear that. <laughs> 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 we got a homie Not named Lucky, and that was the realest shit you could have said. <laughs> and so your switch was, I want the guys to support this. I used to be like. <laughs> And I'll really be with a nigga for like a year straight, month straight. Nigga be like, wait, you a real rapper? Like, like that world, that shit, <laughs> niggas didn't even believe that shit. Like, niggas be like, you a, wait, you a really a rapper? Like, that shit crazy. They come to one of my shows like, what the fuck? Yeah. Like, that's how that shit was. Like, so when drill music was like going crazy, like you never even thought to make like a drill song or some shit? Like, nah, I just thought it'd be like the grading of my personality to try to do that <laughs> shit. Like, I really just never wanted to try that shit. <laughs> I was rapping about the same shit as them, just on the Clams Casino beat, basically. <laughs> <laughs> like, I used to rap about all that type shit. <laughs> 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 Literally. <laughs> <laughs> I fuck with Clams Casino. Shouts out to Clams no Casino, bad, bro. No Clams Casino, go real nigga, man. With hard beats too. Mm-hmm. Clams Casino, sick. You think you would get on one now? Yeah. Would you make a song like Old Lucky X? Have you like in, in your studio time when you're alone? Have sometimes you? I be thinking I be. Sometimes I think I do it. Then they be like, "We missed the old lucky." I be like, "I thought I was just trying." <laughs> it's crazy because you do bar. You still definitely bar the fuck up. You still sometimes bar the fuck up. But I mean, like on like a one of them type of beats. Like, have you even in your own time did it on some like? Just... I don't know because I never used to like that shit in the first place. What you mean? Like I didn't used to listen to myself. Like you really? Me for that. I never used to listen to myself. So then, what was your inspiration in rapping like that? Chance the rapper? Yeah, a little bit. That's crazy. To Chicago, say, you know. I'm just saying. Chicago. Oh, you wanna know how I found Chance? And Vic and this all one day. Look, it used to be on Wednesday. It used to be the shit called U Media downtown. I heard about that. Yeah, my homie took me to fucking. <laughs> uh, he like, let's go uh, downtown. It was like Wednesday. I went to see Chance. These niggas was like in the library, really rapping. I'm like, damn, this shit raw as hell. I went home the same day. So mom was like, yeah, I'm finna really rap now. Like. Chance really inspired me to rap like that, but not. I never really wanted to necessarily be like him. But even though people don't know, Chance used to be bad as hell back in the day. I ain't trying to mess up his what you call it. He fake used to be bad as hell. I heard that. Like he was a fighter. And yeah, that doing type shit. Drugs and selling weed <laughs> yeah. and all kind of shit. He wasn't so Christian. <laughs> yeah. Ain't gonna lie, to rapping in the library is some of the most like lyrical shit you yeah. can do. Yeah, yeah. 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 Like, yeah. Like, that, you don't get no more lyrical in, in the library. You supposed to be talking. Oh, yeah. no, <laughs> it's like you don't get that's no more why people like me. That's why me is so unique because I I get to really like. I really am like I can show like both sides of Chicago. It's not a lot of people can show like both sides of Chicago. That's mm-hmm. crazy. It's like a really, it's like a whole nother side of Chicago that y'all do not know. Like like a hipster side, like, or like Wicker a, Park like, hipstered out. Like yeah, um, like nobody ever talk about that though. Yeah, you know? they don't talk about that. It ain't really. T- I mean, I think you may be the only person from it. You yeah, literally, chance, maybe literally. And Chance is a full blown, you know, Christian. So it's just yeah. you. now though it is the young niggas because it's like it was juice. It's a lot of young niggas like who. Stop! I don't because they gonna be like I'm. Nah, <laughs> right, yeah. right, let's move on. 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 Oh move shit! On. What, what do you think? Some of the positives. That's my topic. And right negatives. <sighs> I've been waiting for this. Not really though. It's no positives. 
<laughs> when you think about it, it's really no positive. Nah, it's not one positive. We've had this conversation no yeah, more. Yeah, yeah. It's just delicious. Yeah, yeah, it's just yeah, it's just crazy. I feel like y'all should watch Jamarcus Russell documentary if y'all want to know about lean. Who? Jamarcus Russell. Jamarcus Russell. Who was Jamarcus Russell? You don't Russell? remember Jamarcus the Russell? Quarterback. He was drinking lean. That was his. That's wrong. No bad though. That's what happened to him, bro. He's supposed to be a great quarterback. He bro. was drinking really? lean. Really? Yeah. Yeah, right, right. the whole yeah. time he was drinking lean the whole time. Swear to God, that's crazy. Yeah, mm. and it's just so addictive. Like imagine something that like, all right, it make you feel a certain way, but then it also tastes good as fuck. Amazing. Like, that's different. Like this new generation of kids, like they be drinking Tris and shit. That's crazy it's to insane. me. That's crazy. Yeah, disgusting. that's crazy. But like somebody made me. I I thought niggas was being cheap at first, but somebody told me some shit like. Now you got a people. A lot of niggas just started sipping during the pandemic, and that was their first lean, so mm-hmm. they connected to that shit. So they have no clue. But yeah, it's no positives. It's just all negatives. You gotta just it's just it's expensive. the person you is. Yeah, yeah. it's expensive, yeah. detrimental. It's just, isn't it? I ain't gonna lie. That's mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. I, I used to have this thing. Fuck up your I don't do it no more. That's why I like having friends that like the same. Cause I, like I, you know, like you got a friend that he think he in competition with you. This is a little cheat code. Just drink some lean with him for like two weeks. Then he gonna realize he can't. You know, like the niggas be a competition with you. That shit, baby. Nah, your friends know that. Your friends that when you start when you that lean shit, it's not. A, it's not like you cannot do it. Yeah. You can't you, do it unless, unless you, you can do unless it. Because yeah, if yeah. you pull that green out, <laughs> if you pull that green out and try to have a conversation, try to try to try to fucking. Doing them like you know, I remember we did that just video. Drink, just drink when we did that video, you thought I was saying green. I was yeah, saying, I was, yeah, I was like, I was, I was so and then the edited, edited green, and then and then Ari uh. made the drink green when you poured it out. I like green. You should kill yourself, big geek boy. I'ma heal myself. Like, let me make this green. The most green I can make. <laughs> yeah, I was like, oh, what? <laughs> no, nah, in the rack though, they was like, that shit like six shades nah, of green. Look, look, niggas in the rack like, damn, that little bitch, look at this, y'all he turn, he pouring that shit out. <laughs> oh. You know what? Uh, you, know, uh, you know what, niggas? Uh, it takes the oh, smallest yeah. thing to you impress them. It out, for you sure. know, yeah. Back home, back, <laughs> yeah. back home, no, for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How much you think you spent on it? I don't like thinking about that. Yeah. What's, yeah. The, most, what's the most you pay for a pint? Yeah. Though? I won't say if you hide it. <laughs> Look, I remember this. I remember when I used to be like coming up. I remember niggas used to be like, "Yeah, I just charged young thug five thousand dollars." Like, I remember lean man used to just like take, like they used to take pride in like waxing a rapper. Yeah. So I just realized. Still do. I just realized three months ago. I turned into that niggas take pride in taxing me. I didn't realize it. I thought I just didn't care, like, bro, because I'm not finna go back like, and forth. Like, like, I'm not finna do that So I be thinking like But yeah I'm really a victim Out here though Like for real <laughs> I'm really a victim With that shit Alright so what is it 40 Yeah 42 right, That shit cool. was recent too I'm, though I'm, I'm, I'm five I'm like I think But you probably did that three, Two three oh, years ago yeah, yeah I did that recently Like how recently like three, four months ago. Like, <laughs> <laughs> recently. Like, Where was you in the And middle? COVID, they was waxing. Like, type shit, like, getting off tour type shit. Oh, but, okay. Yeah. Man, four grand this year. Yeah, four grand this year is crazy. Yeah, that's insane. Yeah. But five grand any year is cra- all no, of it's crazy. During COVID, no, it's not. Cause all, remember, because they thought well, Wack was going to extinct. No, you cannot. Remember, everyone was saying Wack was going extinct. Remember, bro, bro, was bro, was bro, that's bro, what that's how they, do. they do it every yeah, year. No, no, but that's the first time. Niggas do that. That's the first time, though. They do it every year. First time. Let me get CVS out of stock. That's what I tell the niggas. No, no, no. No, but the first time, the first time, remember, a nigga was telling everyone really thought it when they had that little message going on. That shit ain't going nowhere. That's somebody medicine, bro. They were sitting around that screenshot saying, "Man, you gotta try to get all your walk out save it." Everyone, everyone. Somebody medicine Everybody not going nowhere. Yes, you think you got people are living somewhere? off this? That was because Justin Bieber, nigga. I understand. Cal, that's man, Cal, Cal Massey, bro. Yeah. yeah, that's Justin Bieber, Lil Twist, and Cal Massey type shit. That's they fuck. <laughs> <laughs> they need to be held accountable. Yeah, I swear to God, I'll be they mad be as hell niggas don't be holding niggas Justin accountable Bieber, shit like that. Lil Twist, and Cal Massey. That's a crazy thing. They like the government, like. The government, like, what? Nigga, y'all got this little Canadian boy on Drake? Like, what if it was in Canada? Is in Canada. Damn. Yeah. He was right there. Yeah. I think Sean Kingston. Won't hold, I think Sean Kingston put. Stop. Yeah. 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 This gonna be a this wow. gonna be a funny one. <laughs> wow. <laughs> we gonna move on. We gonna. <laughs> wow. Okay. Uh. Do you ever? <laughs> hey, don't you know when they say um, 
they want to owe you back, they're going to say that forever, no matter what you do. Yeah. Yeah, because look, <laughs> I just thought about that too, though. Game, you can do something like if you're a rapper, you can say, like, yeah, you can drop songs for people, and they're gonna say it's not the same. You might as well just go further with what you want to do, make mm-hmm. music for yourself, yeah, like literally. Like, like you can never please everybody because Game. I don't think the fans really know what they want. Hell they just, no, they don't. You can't listen to them because you get what they want, they're gonna be like, nigga, why do you think, bro? You just told me you wanted this, yeah, it's on so nothing like the snippet. Man, fuck you, <laughs> <laughs> bitch! Stop listening yeah, to music, that early, ass, that, Like you don't have to listen to me. Bro. You pay for subscriptions. Just listen to somebody else. That's really good. Um, you think you'll ever stop? But lean, yeah. Probably. I thought I'd never stop popping pills. I stop popping pills. But lean though, pills don't taste good. Lean tastes good. <laughs> no, that shit tastes too good. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it's further in life. You know, I'm ten months clean. That's what I'm saying. I'm I'm like eight months clean off pills. That's what's up. Yeah. All pills? Yeah, all pills. I don't pop no pills. Respect that. Yeah. Ten Zans in a day. I think that was like ten years ago. I know, but I'm saying even that's even crazier. That's a fucking sixteen year old. <laughs> ten Zans is a sixteen year old in one day, bro. Yeah, we used to be crazy, gang. You gotta do a lot of shit to forget a lot of shit. We used to be tripping. <laughs> Somebody in Chicago niggas is real trauma zombies. I learned that shit in Chicago, like when we was popping thirties. And our first a lot time, of ecstasy out there, yeah. Look, yeah, yeah, yeah. But look, the downers took Chicago over Like when I start Hanging around the Detroit people And shit I'm thinking We all like junkies Like yeah we vibing Let's pop some perks And they used to be like Like give me a 10 I'm like what And they like Nah bro We don't pop 30s out here I realized that was Chicago Fucked up Wait 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 What age Was you in the 30s With the 30s that's the thing though Everyone in Chicago 30s back was, then? No, no, no 2018, 2017 nah, like, Yeah, but 2017 like 2017 when the Perks started to take out mm-hmm. Yeah Before it wasn't That's we were, crazy Yeah, we didn't even know about mm-hmm. Perks and shit out there mm-hmm. Until like 2017 Too many rappers I met from Chicago Was heavy on the 30s Yeah, Perks yeah. in Chicago And they were the only ones like, doing it I remember back then shit. They were the only ones doing 30s Trauma zombies, baby Alright, so let's it's Let's good, get man. into these memes Right, you might be the most memeable rapper, right? Who who else could be more memeable than this nigga's topping me now? No, yeah, the most memeable rapper. The most memeable rapper. Yo, you low key tied with me now, though. The tattoo picture last week. <laughs> the tattoo yeah. Nigga said, yeah, said "Bow like an autopsy," but that shit was so funny. Yeah, I see that, <laughs> there was some good ones. But now nah, the tattoos really ones. hard because, like, the way like <sighs> niggas like us be wanting our shit done, niggas don't be wanting it. Like, I man, know. I got all the tattoos. Most of them at one time. For yeah, free me too. When me I was too. scamming. So can we can we talk about the? Can you explain the? Yeah, where did that come from? You know I be thinking I'm in a mob, so I just be saying like certain shit like shh, no see shit. Like I be doing that because of that. Like, Wait, bro, you, the video when you were trying to walk in New York outside? That was here. I went to Can Can oh, show. Oh, that was in L.A. Yeah, I went to little Can Can show. We Pick have Ken-Ken. to put that clip up. Have yeah. you seen that video when he trying to walk through? It? You're going to cry laughing. <laughs> Yeah, I had something in my bag and I could get in trouble for what was in my bag. Mm-hmm. So I'm like, I pull up, I'm like, yo, these kids crazy. And mm-hmm. I'm trying to get back to the truck. I'm just having a panic attack in my head right now. Like, yo, like it's police right all these white kids, mm-hmm. big ass black nigga with dress. So I was just, I was yeah, trying to get, just trying to get out of the way. Literally. Mm-hmm. I just went. Do you ever look in your, in your Reddit? No, nah, hell no. Nah. You know, they say you're, they think you may be a Freemason. <laughs> All right, so oh, you, I know what you're talking you, about. They yeah. brought that for that meme. Mm-hmm. I know what you're talking about. Can you confirm? That's crazy, though. I'm honored for that, for that type of shit. They think I'm a Freemason. Yeah. I'm um, talking about so, but you can confirm you are not. Yeah, everybody know I'm a Jesus lover. Right. Big Jesus lover. Jesus lover here. Yeah. <laughs> Hashtag Jesus lover. <laughs> uh, I'm just honored they, they think I was a Mason. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, well, a Freemason, not a paid Mason. Um, do, do, do. What's the difference? I, hey, well, I would be a paid Mason. Wait, what's the difference? I, I'm just saying, I don't do shit for free. The only thing I did free was this. <laughs> <laughs> well, we appreciate you, brother. We appreciate it. <laughs> You're helping us out. You're helping us out. Shit. Yeah. Uh, no, I really don't. No, really don't. With that, though, this is the only, like, I'll be one. Everybody want to do interviews, explain themselves, but it's like, who am I gonna like? 
But yeah. I was so happy as somebody, a regular person, a rapper, making a platform, yeah. like, literally. Like, yeah, yeah. Literally. That's real. We appreciate it, too. You don't do this for real. <laughs> like, and it's crazy because you talk a fucking lot. That's what I'm saying. I'm a big-ass kid, so I don't be really going on camera because no, I, I want people to take my kidness for granted. Nah, exactly. I feel you. So, what memes? Do you do you, do they ever affect you? What, the memes? Yeah. Uh, not really. Only when they were saying I was fat because of like drugs, and I was fat because I eat a lot. Yeah, that's what that was making me fat. <laughs> okay, <laughs> do with drugs. Yeah, like that's you never got a chance to explain me. it. Yeah, yeah. That's real. but it's really my karma. Like, I'm really a. I grew up a bully. Like yeah. blood of Jesus. Like it's over now. But that's like a little karma in life. Like you know, like I use on niggas' ass. <laughs> yeah, that's right. and and I feel like I don't know. Wait, speaking of growing up, nigga, you grew up in Chicago. That's like war <laughs> zone. <laughs> Video game, no dead ass. That's like a what, what's what part yeah. of Chicago? I'm from out west. That's like the that's the west side. Uh, uh, Me though, I'm like a nigga that's like from from Harlem that's always in Brooklyn type shit though. Cause mm. you feel me? Type well, shit. Was my, where? my mama lived on the east side too, so I was always on the east side and low end. You feel me? Like I really come from a product of like a split household, so I had mm. two different cribs. Yeah, type Stayed shit. Stayed away from that south side though. The east side is the south side. That's what I was saying. That's what I was telling him. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what we was getting at. And so, the niggas uh, be getting too mad in Chicago, bro. Why? They don't even get mad. They just have no like these, value for human life there. <laughs> like they don't even get mad. Like, True. do you, you you still live there, right? Hell no. No. Do you go back? Yeah, I gotta go back sometimes, but you don't you dread it. I don't dread it. I love it. But then when I'm back, it's just nothing to do in Chicago but get in trouble. Like, yeah. like the only way to be safe in Chicago is to be in trouble. Like, you kind of gotta leave Chicago. Huh? Yeah, there's no way. Like, yeah, you gotta get out of there, bro. Them niggas. I think everyone's left, have right? No regard for life, bro. Has anyone stayed? <laughs> Mm-mm. No. Everybody. everybody gonna shoot their video in the hood here, and there. Yeah, yeah. But niggas be getting but the fuck up. Gone. Yeah. Yeah, it's just too. It's it's really like that. Do you think people look at you a certain way because you left? Like, do you have anybody from back home ever say anything to you? Hell no. No. Nigga never say nothing to me like that. Mm. If not they if they understand, but like in reality, if somebody know me, they know they had never say nothing like that because they had make me come home. Yeah. Like. <laughs> nigga, I never say no shit like that to me. No, for sure. Literally. What you was trying to say? Just um, going to school in Chicago, like growing up, going to school in Chicago. I, I got something shit. for you. Like that I'm from shit, the I West Side. I'm telling you, like, so look, imagine me, like, go, you like, remember the bopping shit? Y'all remember that the dancing shit? I'm from yeah. that side of Chicago. I don't know. So dude, I remember. But I don't know type shit. I, I was going crazy. crazy. What you, I don't know <laughs> that. <laughs> Yeah, it's like, that's what that shit. Oh, comes so I also used to do that. Yeah, that's what I used to do. But no, nah, it just like so I, that's why I end up on the west side because I used to be in school, right? And niggas used to be like, like bopping and shit in the lunchroom and shit. I used to be like, damn man, I hate this shit. <laughs> so, <laughs> that's how I end up being like on the south side and shit. Like my daddy called me a traitor, like you know, like that type of shit. So you really just hated the niggas you went to school with. Yeah, besides like five people, y'all know who y'all is. <laughs> 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 that shout out to the men. No, okay, for sure, for sure. Important question, and I'm very curious on how you, your response. Do you think you're underground? I mean, I don't know. I'm whatever. Like, I don't do, care. Do people still say you're underground? I don't. I your see, shows I see, are huge. You stream huge. I see people that be saying, like, people be saying, like, lucky not underground no more, but I don't want to be, like, the, the M word, so... I want to be like underground, like you regardless. don't want to be. No, nah, like what I makes do. you not underground no more though. Like, like I don't know. I think my brain is always like, if you on a radio, you get like an award show invite. Or <laughs> like if I saw you on a BET award show, I like how V's was at the BET on the red carpet, yeah. yo, his way out of there. Yeah. Honestly, I don't think V's is underground anymore. I don't think he is street rap nigga no more. But to me, at our generation, that's what I'm saying. In our generation, the underground got nothing to do with the streets, like. Like no. at our generation, no, it's the internet. Like, yeah, like yeah, yeah. so. But your shows are too big to be underground. I'm three, okay, one, two, one, two, three, three. Yeah. Three, 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 that's fair. I mean, I think I think it's a split. Tw- I think it's a split com- conversation. I think a lot of people still say you like the last of the underground, and then a lot of people say you're not. Yeah, that's lit though. Regardless. Yeah. You who are your top five favorite Chicago rappers? Uh, Sosa, of course. Swerve, Dirt. No Twister. I, I mean, yeah, but that don't count. Oh yeah, Kanye Twist Kanye. Yeah. 
Salsa. Salsa. Swear. Yeah. Do you have one more? Anything? One more person in there? Soldier Boy. Juice. You know, Soldier Boy likes him. He's from Chicago. Yeah, he did. Soulja Boy. Yeah, I, I, he did. Soldier Boy. We made, I, we made bow. He's I, like, Cicero, we used okay. to be tweaking off that yeah. shit. Yeah. Since Rock's in Atlanta. Oh, yeah. Shout out to my nigga Antonio. Yo, I'ma holla at your phone. 24 Chicago 7, we shit. blowing that smoke. Yeah. On them goons, on us go. On patrol. H2 home with the H and talk. Me and my niggas, we got a ball. Make, Make it, it rain, rain in, in the mall. mall. In the mall in New York. Get it, man. 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 Hold on. One more bar. Two more bar. Soulja Boy. 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 Bro, he one. He from. He think he from Chicago. He also think he from Orlando. Honestly, you is from Chicago, so it's your boy. Not you think. He really from <laughs> Alabama. That. He really from Alabama. He from where he say he at. For sure, whatever you say, for sure. Whatever you can't tell Soldier Boy. For sure, whatever you say, whatever you say. My bad, my bad. A lot of love for Soldier. That's my guy. What do you think? Um, what do you think your best song you ever made is? New drink. No bad. So that's why she never get out of me. I love that song. And they, they say it's the two-year anniversary for that song now. Nah. Damn. Because they had me really? fucked up. Because I remember when I made Wake Up Lucky. That's why I don't, like, that's why I want artists when, when like, your project come out. Don't listen to what the fuck the kids say. I mean, I mean, you got to, obviously. But I remember they was like, what the fuck is this? And I was really, like, I'm like, I thought I'm thinking I'm being, like, progressive making Wake mm-hmm. Up Lucky. So I was really mad that people, like, because all my music come from my heart. So I was really mad that people think they can, like, like, give me a pen on something that come from my heart. So I made New Drink. So that's one of my favorite songs ever. I just made it. Like, so, so what's the difference between listening to what the kids say and not following and doing what you think is right? Like, from my heart. I don't know. I can't tell you. I just know what I'm going to do. <laughs> I can't tell nobody. <laughs> like, I swear to God. Sure. I think, again, to what you said, the kids just don't know what they want. Bro, I think they just Bro this shit like McDonald's now. Like, yeah. nigga, like, they don't, like... Mm-hmm. Like I this just that comparison, bro. This shit, they just get this shit galore like too easy. Like they don't appreciate nothing yeah. no more. Like you, you can just say me? anything at any time to yeah. anyone you want yeah, to. But you was yeah. really, oh yeah, you are talking about the internet. Yeah, yeah. But on wake up, lucky you really going on that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> like, yeah. like I was fucked up making that shit too. I was like really in the trenches, like sleeping on my little sister bunk bed, like fucked up, like yeah. had to go back home type shit. I was really fucked up making that. Yeah. Like no bet. So you was rapping like you had to pay your license. Like, Swear to God, like I had to get a career. Period. Yeah. Like that's how. Fuck the light bill. Hey, that shit paid off. You ever think back to that shit? I yeah, you want, bro? Cause you know it took me a minute to like appreciate features. I had to realize like you like pressing me, not pressing me, but no like, pressing. Like you. yeah, like to do pressing that. You. Like bro, I needed that. I didn't understand that, but I really needed that. You like, had, what? Did you hate doing features? Yeah, just, you just bro. Did. Look, this why I'm gonna tell you this first story. Alright, so look. Like 2016, 2017, I was in LA, right? We was at the studio, the Big E studio, and this nigga Famous Dex came in there. And I was in there, he like, yeah, we gotta do a song, brother. Like, I love, love, I love, bro. He like, we gotta do a song. I'm like, all right, we did the song, and I did the song, and I dropped it, and he never posted it or nothing. Mm. So I'm like, what am I doing no song with no niggas no more? Fuck that shit. Yeah. Like, literally, that's where that came from. Yeah. Yeah. Like, literally. I, Cause I, I, you know, I didn't realize it was such a big deal that I he had a song with me. Cause I, until I learned, you had no songs with nobody. Mm-hmm. Yeah, even in the moment when you was doing it, though, I was like, I was like, that nigga's not about to pull up and do this shit, but like, yeah. that's what I was thinking. Like, I had a pressure to story. do that video too. <laughs> hey, look, what's up, nigga? What's up, gang? I just bro? play that shit in there. For real? <laughs> hey, on the speaker. We need to shoot that video, bro. I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna lead him out, but I'm gonna come back out next week. Nigga, let's shoot tonight. My videographer right here. It's in the video. Bro, I didn't have no it's fucking like my clothes, right here. Like, come on, cause he I didn't have no fucking clothes. Like, <laughs> you like, trying to spin it on camera. I feel like, like we was, right was never going to do it. I swear, if we didn't was, do it right then, bro, yeah. look, exactly, exactly. Yeah. Bro, I was not going to do it, bro. Yeah. You put that, you fresh as hell. I ain't got no clothes. I'm like, bro, I'm not trying to shoot no video on this fucking outfit. I took a picture in this shit three times already. <laughs> <laughs> like, but, what the fuck? but nobody thought about. Nobody cared about that. They was happy that video came out. Yeah, facts though. That song is fucking huge. Yeah, right. That's a fucking slapper. I'm. I'm, I'm really glad we did that song. I, I swear to God. Yeah, that's a that's a really great one. Is it wrong? That's when you. That was when you first started getting on your run. Like, yeah, hey, y'all nah, got me hey, fucked up. Nah, like, nah, nah. Hell, nah. no, nah, nah. Hey, no. I'm still off then. Yeah. Listen to what I'm saying. That's when you really was like, y'all got me fucked up. Like you was going out your way to make people know that you know how to rap. Like, that two years ago. 
That's not two years ago. That's a yeah. minute ago now. No, you're right. Oh yeah, that's the old house. Yeah, yeah like that's yeah, when you was like doing the shit with the Detroit yeah. niggas. You was yeah. really making sure like people yeah. knew you knew how to rap. I, like, I was doing Detroit shit then. Right before it. That was right, little boat three. Yeah, that was before. yeah, that was little boat three. I was right when I dropped Little Three. That's right before COVID. That's the era, nigga. Yeah. That's the era. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah you're right. So, is is there anyone that you you really want to collab with that you haven't yet? Nah, not really. Really? Yeah. No, nobody. Not really. Besides people I grew up like listening to, like growing up, like mm-hmm. like probably like Lil Wayne, Drake, or Thug. We're the mm-hmm. only people like. But they don't count to me as like regular people. Like <laughs> they like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Really like, yeah. yeah. Right, I get it. So, um, <clears throat> okay, let's move on. When did you? Oh, Cardi. Yeah, that'd be sick. Cardi. That'd be a good song. Hey, when you got that chance to rapper feature back in the day, but that shit felt like the champ, like Super Bowl type shit. Like everybody. Gang. Like, Y'all gotta know how that song came about. Like I know I keep talking about, like bro, like I really was in the trenches when we did that song. I was off ecstasy and Zans, gang. Like I had got ecstasy cool. and Zans. Bro, I'm telling you, gang, it was so random. Like I'm in Chicago the, shit, bro. Bro, I'm in. I was. I was. I was in L Town. I was like on Iowa and Leclerc. And I'm FaceTime, I'm biting down, and they face, like, like, come to the studio, like, Young Chop, like, yeah, come to the studio. Then Chance was there the same day. Like, we did that shit, like, it was, it felt like a championship, but I was so high, it just happened. Like, mm. you know what I'm saying? Like, that shit just young happened. Young Chop. Then he gave me the Zan chain. I everybody was used to so pull up, turned. well, everybody used to pull up the Young Chop crib and recording shit or something? Uh, What's the other What's the Asian guy Yeah name? Yeah Ken. Out West. Ken. 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 But, yeah, Ken But Young Chop His brother baby mama Used to really live on my block That's how I got Really really cool with him I was walking to the gas station One time And this nigga Chop brother Saved my life bro Papa look This why I'm so fucking loud And bragging I'm like Yeah I just took it From my neighborhood Like well I really I used to like Bring niggas from out south and over east to come rob people you, from my you neighborhood. You blocking my light, brother. You, you blocking my light, brother. <laughs> on, don't fuck me up. I look good. Now. <laughs> no, 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 no. Get the hell out of the way. Look, man. look, look. <laughs> so I used to bring niggas from like where I migrated to to come poke niggas from my neighborhood and shit like that. So I, uh, I'm in a car. I'm thinking. I'm like. I'm like. Yeah. Child. I'm, yeah, fuck, I'm like, yeah, I just poked um, Buddy Never Movie. I just robbed the nigga, like, <laughs> and then a nigga, like, he, like, chop text me, like, because they just gonna drop me off at the crib and they taking me around the corner. I'm like, wait, why y'all not taking me to the crib? <laughs> he, like, bro, the nigga in the back seat, that's what you talking about. I'm like, damn, he texted my phone like that. Like, chop really used to be my man's gang. Like, we used to ride around all of his mama van and all that type of shit. Like, yeah. like, for real, for real. I ain't gonna lie, bro. If I would have been in the car, like, <laughs> you know that You know that Do you know that's how I felt that time You called me bro. I don't oh, even want to get into it On oh, camera But damn that Bro was I know you, I know Bro I know you did bro I, I had to make like, you feel like that I too said, I had to make you feel like that That's why when Chop was getting that call, that call That's why when Chop was Going through all that shit On social media But I was like He tripping I'm like man Just let him get through it bro That's why I like, <laughs> Oh you just You understand yeah. One time I tell you let, Fuck it let's talk about it One time I was I was I met this chick and that metaphor boy was chilling watching a movie. And then this nigga called me. I'm home alone. He Imagine called that. me. I'm like, what's up, brother? He's like, what you doing? I'm like, shit, I'm chilling with a little vibe. He said, hey, step away real quick. I'm like, what's up? He's like, bro, that bitch trying to line you up. I'm like, yeah, you, had gun, you had guns in the crib? Yeah, imagine, it's like yeah, 3 in the morning. Yeah, of course, you, you was probably crib. vibing out. But I was chilling. He probably like watching the stupid morning, ass movie like, and everything. I'm like, bro, I'm like, bro walk shit, away like, from that. Like, I'm like, bro, walk away from that bitch right now. Wait, what happened? Like, wait, what happened? What happened? What happened? Yo, I came back to. You know bitch, you, you tripping, bitch. I was, <laughs> like, I was just looking at her like. I was just looking at her like. She like, I'm going to call my Uber. She had a car. She was like, she was like. Uh, what's 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 wrong? I'm like, you gotta go, and she was like, oh no, my BD did something, didn't he? I was like, you gotta go, and she started crying. Yo, anytime somebody I would have called twelve, crying, the bitch started crying. Like, well, I got no, security. I got home security. Right, I would have called twelve. I would have like, told them to call their people in the thing. Yeah, you know? She was trying to say <laughs> she had a crazy hu- boy, baby daddy that had probably locate uh, tagged her location, her car. I don't know. I didn't give a fuck. I was like. Bitch, Get out of here, bitch. No, Never come back. Man. I, I did like, call oh, 12 on that Martin. bitch. But just imagine getting that call at 3 in the morning. Like, hmm? No, just imagine that. Though. You 3 a.m., you chilling, you laid up. I'm calling she 12 on bitches. I'm keep saying. I'm like, the fuck? Like, you, you getting the You like. Hey, hold up, hold up, hold up. When you was doing the podcast with DC, DC says, man, I had to take the charge. You tried to save him. You like, don't say that. <laughs> <laughs> you tried to save him. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Dylan is a strange guy, man. He's a, he's a strange guy. All right, let's move on. Um, When did you realize that you, like, didn't have 
Well, first off, do you realize how crazy your fan base is? Mm -hmm. You know, right? So, mm -hmm. at what point did you start to realize like they weren't like a normal fan base? Uh, two years ago. And like, because like, what what was it? I probably made them like that though. I don't know. I people, I really be, I'm like. I be tweeting like y'all know I be going on rents and I, when I delete it I be stop thinking about that shit till it's time for me to do it again yeah. like I don't really be think like cause I be getting mad I remember I used to before I got like kind of got oh, I used to look up my name and they used to say I was insecure but I'm like nigga I don't got no label or nothing that's how I gotta see like who pe how people fuck with me like mm. so I just had to that's when I really realized like looking up your name and just seeing shit but when you block it out I just not think about it yeah do you but, do that now are you more you block it out more or are you still. I block it out, but the funny shit though, like people gonna send me the funny shit, so I'm gonna see the funny shit for yeah. sure. But I just be blocking everything out, cause TikTok is new to me. Mm -hmm. Like that whole little shit, that's really new to me. Mm -hmm. Like, what's the craziest thing a fan's done? I keep saying it, like when they be crying and shit. Hey, what you mean? Like they'll just see you and just yeah, start just crying, start crying, or like that they shit. Yo, <laughs> just see me and be crying. I'd be like, damn, nigga. <laughs> I remember when I used to be like, oh, depressed nigga used to be like, bro, you saved my life. I used to be like, who's going to save my life? <laughs> <laughs> I swear to God. Okay, I swear to God. <laughs> Fans always getting their life saved. Yeah. God damn. God damn, 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 damn. <laughs> what do you think about another interesting thing I realized that you have a real big woman fan base. A lot of girls. That's new. Too. That's new, yeah, but a lot of them. Like, yeah, that's new because like, it used to be just sweaty kids. Yeah, but now it's like the good looking. <laughs> yeah. like, I fuck with that. That's decent. a vibe. That's yeah, a vibe. the decent. And it's became this thing where like where guys are kind of like like what you know about that yeah, kind of like if they listen to you, <laughs> yeah, kind of like how you know about that? What you know about that? You know what I'm saying? Well, that's lit though. Yeah, yeah. What, what you think? What do you think your average uh, girl fan looks like? Oh no! I'd rather not say. No. <laughs> <laughs> That's fair. That's fine. All right, come on. All right, well, I don't look. like pissing the girl. I could piss everybody else off, nah, but I don't want to piss the nah, girls off. I respect that. I respect that, Mitch. Um, anything that you wanna? I fuck on? with Mitch. Wait, what happened? What song was that? I fuck with Mitch. Right. He like his lyrical shit. No, nah, no, nah, this nigga oh. Mitch texted me. It was something happened. I forgot. He like. Yeah, nigga, you should use this beat. But I ain't know who it was. Some though, like oh. he, was just, he was just so confident about it though. <laughs> like, who the fuck is this nigga? <laughs> then it's Mitch though. I fuck with that. I'm like, oh, that makes sense though. Like Wait, was on, that, was, that was that was just, that was the tens. <laughs> you know, sometimes tens give you that extra. Yeah. <laughs> That's one of your beats. That yeah, makes yeah. sense. Yeah. 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 Niggas don't be realizing like, bro, I be writing. So yeah. sometimes like, if I be like, I be telling niggas like, yeah, this hard. I'ma get to it later, cause it's really like hard for me to fucking write right yeah. now. Like, you in the block right now? I don't think it's a block. I just think it's a writing cycle. Like you gotta get in the cycle to do it. Like you know. Mm. But you do right. I've never though. actually. I, I, I think how many times we recorded together? Five times, maybe yeah, four, five never. times. I never actually caught you ever. in your face. Ever, ever. Every time we do it, I'll go and then you'll go later. Yeah. But I've never actually. Oh, you never seen recording? No, no, not really. <laughs> Every time we've done it a couple times, he's always extremely high. Well, or, what about that time we went? We are, no, we, we sat the there. Song was for already hours. Done. Yeah, yeah. I just the hopped on it. Done. I just hopped on it. Like right before y'all came. Oh, but every mean? session we've done is like that. He'll have the song, I'll get on it, or I'll do it, and he'll be like, all right, I'm going to send it to you. Well, wait, why is it like that? Like, that's just how you, like, like you take a long time for you to record, or, or what? Or like, sometimes it be like, too many people, and I'm still kind of yeah, shy. I feel that. Like, I feel that, you on that. Sometimes, that. yeah. I've gotten comfortable. I've just been doing it so long, I've gotten to that place. But I get that, definitely. You don't yeah, want it. No, you you can, never know what niggas is thinking. Yeah. You can rap in I don't room. like, that's my thing. 50 niggas in there. Yeah, I don't care. Niggas talking, joking, all that shit. I don't want to think about what you're thinking. I just want to make this. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, see, that's the. I can't out. He can do that shit. He can rap in a room with 100 people. I didn't have a. Bro, I got to a point of having a choice, man. You start hanging out. Like, when I was rapping with them or rapping with Thug, man, it's 100 niggas in that room. That's who broke me out of that. Detroit people. Yeah, oh, yeah. That's who broke me oh, out of that. Room, they, bro, no, nah, but they just broke like I learned. And they how don't to, respect you, right? I, I learned how to record. I learned how to record like on the spot. Like I learned how to do I ain't used to know how to do that. Like mm -hmm. all that coming back later, I learned how to do that shit right there. Like mm -hmm. I learned that from Detroit people. They're gonna finish the song. Yeah, they're gonna finish yeah, the song. Yeah, yeah. V's gonna take 17 hours, but he's gonna finish bro, the song. Bro, I got a funny ass story with V's on that shit, on that, on that song we got on his project, right? So we are uh we at Mob Crib, that's Ray. We in Mob Crib, it's like the whole gang and everybody in there. So, you know, me and V's make a song, all the young niggas gonna run to the table. Like, like so I'm like, I text V's like, don't let nobody get on there. So, on that song, that's why he rapping all the way to the end of the beat. <laughs> 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 so, 
like this nigga fried, bro. I swear to God. Nah, rap it to the end of the day. It's crazy. They think he going off. I've done that. I've done that a couple times. I've, on God, I've done that. Damn, that nigga V is going off. Finish that beat off. Yeah, he's still recording. Yeah, he's going Bunch crazy in there. Niggas still recording. When you start seeing niggas writing, they bring no, like we over, we over the studio. We in the dark watching Power now. Like, this nigga still recording the song and shit. Like, All right, he, 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 gonna, he gonna finish that mission. Uh, That's so funny. Um... All right, shit. We got some questions. Wait, before we get into that, what are you doing right now? Are you recording? Are you chilling? Are you just? I'm recording. I'm doing something. I'm about to get into like making my next project. I'm just. Okay. I'm doing some shit right now. Like okay. Some shit, shit. For sure. For sure. Yeah. All right. All right, Mitch. Our first question is actually for you. Um. By the way, if y'all don't know by now, you know if you want to ask us any questions, need any advice, you can hit us up on our Instagram yeah, in the talk. DMs. Yes, sir. All right. Um. Can we know how tall Mitch is in the next episode? He gives like five four. Damn, <laughs> man, they sent us a thousand. <laughs> Mitch is crazy. Five four is crazy. You do not look five four. Hey, V is Mitch crazy. No, 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 no. I'm just, no, no, no. I'm, I'm gonna just let them wonder. Yeah, five four, whatever. Insane. All right, don't cut this out. V is Mitch crazy. <laughs> Why you so <laughs> <you> crazy? <laughs> All right, round two. Been with the same girl almost six years. Shadi doesn't have ambition, to be honest. Love the girl, but honestly, I carry a lot in this relationship. I've avoided cheating as best as I can, but damn, yeah. Shorty, having no ambition, really starting to steer a man down an unfaithful path. What should I do? Bucks. How you, like, with a girl that got no ambition? Like, how you with a girl? Like, a girl supposed to make you have ambition? Or, I don't know. Like, where, where you at? What you mean? Like, I feel like me, like, it depends on how she look. Like, she make me have ambition or something. Like... I don't know. I yeah, can't but it's not about you. We talking about he's saying he do all the work. He got ambition. We talking about she ain't doing nothing. I mean, like welcome to the real world, don't. brother. That's what I'm saying. Like they don't do like, nothing, bro. What do you want? That what you want to do? Like something because they open the bitch up to. So you basically saying you don't mind your girl not doing nothing? Yeah, what the fuck? Like I don't want to go into work having a work boyfriend. Like, mm. What the fuck? Like it's not really. Sound like she want to be on the railroad. Like what the fuck? Like what the fuck? What you think, Mitch? What you got to say to this? Um, listen, brother, ambition or BBL? That's how I look at it. I swear to God. Which one are you going for, brother? I you want to? You want a bitch that's working both. hard, or you, you just want? I'm gonna step in and be the logical one here, okay? Because these brothers are here. I thought right? I was being logical. I no, swear to God. You guys sound like. <laughs> all right, so my turn. All right, let me get in here and talk some sense. All right, first off, brother, you shouldn't have gotten this deep to begin with if she has no ambition. Obviously, no one wants a woman with no ambition. That's cap, bro. I, I do not want a woman around me who does not want to do anything. I'm not saying you have to get a job and go go grow corn at the, or go work at a fucking steel mill, but like 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 you should want to do something with your life, whether it's go get a degree, want to go like even if it's go watch every Harry Potter movie, yeah, like at least want to want to do like, something. My my, my bitch got to want to do something cuz I don't want to do nothing. So we're just going to be a bunch of doing nothing motherfuckers like like, so, <laughs> like you got to have some ambition like Wait, you just said you didn't want her to do nothing. I'm saying though, like you just said, not working, but like other shit though. Like, yeah, well, I never. He never said working. He just said ambition. Yeah, his bitch tripping if she don't got do nothing. Like, yeah. no, that's what I'm saying. That's she. she you remember the what drug commercial? Saying? She just a, a flat motherfucker <laughs> yeah. on the couch. Like, <laughs> that's the, that's what she is. <laughs> I don't know. I guess it depends on my mood. Sometimes I want a bitch that's, you know, what I'm saying, building a church, and then sometimes I just want a bitch that just, I just yeah, building a church is crazy. <laughs> She just there like what the up? bitches that build churches at? Right. <laughs> you know, <laughs> I mean, I know that bitch got some good karma. Yeah. I swear to God, <laughs> <laughs> building a church is crazy. Imagine the building a church and still not getting into heaven. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> That's because you started too late, brother. That's some shit you're trying to do when you Yeah, know, like, man. I feel like you opened the door up for yourself, bro, thinking you was little baby or some shit. <laughs> trying to tell her, like, you know, that type of shit. Like, all right. I thought it went. I'm just saying, like, gang. All of us thinking you was us, like in general, like that's what I'm saying, like just like, like gang, like niggas be opening they self up for that. You like my light again, bro. It's our light. It's our <laughs> that's your light. Your light is good. That's your light. You blocking my light. <laughs> but no, though, like I don't know, niggas be trying to do shit they see on TV. Like what? Like just in general, like the way like taking care of a girl, like yeah, that shit is whack. Bro. Niggas trying to do shit they do they see Come on, on TV. Ain't a lot, brother. You take rules. full care of your girl. So what are you saying? <laughs> but I can do that. This nigga probably can't do that. That's no, what I'm saying. Yeah, for sure. 
So you're been, saying he need to stop. He, he said he do it. He said he do it. And he said he don't cheat. Or he tripping. That's what I'm saying. You need to balance. He need to go take care of another bitch for balance it out. To get some, like, he tripping. He take, take care of a bitch with ambition. He said he ambition. don't cheat. He yeah, he need to that's take care of a bitch. That's what you need to do. So yeah. he need to get a bitch on the yeah. side with ambition. He need to start vibing. He need to get a bitch with ambition. Why would he keep it? That's not cheating. It's just vibing. Yeah, that's just vibing. He don't want to hit or nothing. That bitch is going to go swim and shit. Yeah. When they wake up. Well, for him, he probably want to go up on a mountain and shit, and probably like, I don't know. You just assuming he white, cause come on, faithful for six years, yeah, that yeah, bitch. Yeah, yeah, that's fair. I mean, his bro was really throwing the word on bitch. Yeah, using a, yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah, that, that was the giveaway. Ambition, nigga, what? Well, Wale, he had a whole album named Ambition. I thought he was black because he said he don't cheat. Yeah, well, I ain't gonna yeah. lie. That's what I thought. <laughs> All right, let's get to this third one. I need help because I may or may not be in a situation. <laughs> Mitch would do this. I'm gonna answer before I even say it. He would 100 percent do this. Would you date a correctional shit. officer? Wait, what? Yeah, you tapped in with the underworld. Oh, like okay. Would you date a CEO? Of course, especially as, as like a as a prisoner or as a free nigga. Yeah, nope. As a regular nigga. Bro, I don't think it's no type of bitch I wouldn't date. She comes home like, hey, hey, she come home like, hey, bitch. She come home like, babe, what they was doing today in there? Like, <laughs> <laughs> you know, um, I locked up a couple of you. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, though. Mm-hmm. And what way is it bad to date a correctional, uh, uh, a correctional officer? That's well, good. That's bro, they not good. police for real. They don't care about and the law or nothing. And you can get shit in the wall. Like, that's money, own money. Cause we you can't char- get nothing in. <laughs> we can't do that. I'm just saying it's possible. Not, not, not. Wait, what was I about to say? We, got, we don't even got no yeah. reason to do that. No, nah, we don't. I'm just saying. Like, I ain't gonna lie though, no bro. Not Wait, it is one reason. It's a lot of competition, though. In jail, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, crazy. <laughs> like, I'll be if like, your yo, girl, if your girl, if your girl chooses a nigga locked up in prison over you, who's a free man, bro, you gotta focus on. But yourself. sometimes them niggas a bit more intense, though. You feel me? Like I might. So sad. Like you know what I'm saying? Niggas got that ultra horny game. <laughs> <laughs> like you know, you feel me? Like them niggas. I might walk right past the bitch. The niggas got more like, you feel me? They got a little bit more ambition. Yeah, maybe. like you feel me? Back to that word. Yeah. <laughs> you might see my bitch and hate her. <laughs> she probably hate her at the moment, but flattered. Like tell her friend she ain't gonna tell me about it. But you feel me? Yeah, like talking about it was you oh, know shit. it made you look like a <laughs> man, what like a youth man. <laughs> Like a youthful man. Next subject. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What you doing? Man? You, tri- <laughs> no. you, fool, you tripping. Bro. I'm, no, I'm just saying, like. You tripping. I think you might need a happy dad, bro. <laughs> Speaking of that, shouts out to our sponsor, Happy Dad. And if you didn't know, we got these limited edition Death Row Record Great Flavor Happy Days. Welcome to Death Row Records. <laughs> that was the. Uh, I was doing the dumb down thing. That mean a good thing where I'm from, though. Like, what's the Happy yeah, Dad? Like, yeah, yeah, what they're thinking about? Like, yeah. Like, I was doing <laughs> But it did that That shit didn't look like <laughs> just, Nothing good yeah, was coming yeah. after It's like We're gonna, we gonna <laughs> have that clipped on us I y'all slimed out Happy dad I fucked nah, nah, uh, like uh, right. That's gonna be our angle yeah, yeah. We're fucking up our money God damn it that's shit, We got a good thing going yeah, yeah. Fuck up what we got going what? on over here yeah. Hey It's all good Happy uh, dad <laughs> Thumbs up for happy dad <laughs> What are you talking about uh, <laughs> Well man, we t- That, that man. concludes <laughs> it You know That's another episode Of A Safe Place This <laughs> may be our best episode yet Without question Oh, uh, we fuck. We didn't even introduce ourselves. Um, I'm your host. Hey, wait, wait. You seen that video, uh, bruh? Hold on, but wait, wait. I was doing so good. I know. I'm bro. sorry. Now nah, you low key been going. Cr- you been tripping me out with <laughs> yeah, this. Right? Well, you <laughs> tripping me out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, but I wanted to ask you this before we go. Though. You seen the video when bruh jumped out the crowd and hugged the nigga? <laughs> what? Somebody no cap, the no cap. Yeah, no cap. No, nah, somebody bro. look. It made me so mad because whatever city they was in, they's like, nigga, you making the city look bad. I'm like, how? <laughs> like, nigga, just love no cap. Wait, like, what happened? <laughs> that nigga, he just like, bro, the nigga just ju- like, jumped. Like, imagine you speaking to everybody, the nigga just jumped up and hugged the nigga. Like, <laughs> <laughs> what he do though? How he react? He, 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 he gave him a hug type shit. Yeah. But nigga was like really hugging him though. Like he's yeah. about to start crying. Mm-hmm. Nigga, nigga he wasn't gonna like. It was one of them hugs. Like if no cap didn't let go. He wasn't gonna let go. <laughs> Like one of them type shit. It's like, we gotta put it in here. Cause I, I gotta see it. Uh, that shit is so funny. Uh, random. I don't know why that's on your mind. Kind of weird. But yeah, y'all, this is a safe place, man. By far the best episode yet. You know, what see, saying? I we learned more shit thing. about. Yeah, he said lucky, what man. I said. He said nothing. Lucky X versus Lucky. That shit documentary. Who five four, nigga? Oh God, stop playing.
<laughs> we'll see you guys next week. Yeah, we, we'll see you week, week after next. Would that mean a good thing, though? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> good thing, good thing. <laughs>